Hello everyone. Uh, as you guys probably watch my videos, you know that I'm really into replicating TV, movie cars, and I guess my talent is not going to stop there. Um, I am going to build, as, as you can see, as this is a mini bike, and I am going to build a screen accurate, 100% screen accurate, dumb and dumber bike. And that movie was my wife and I's first movie that we ever went to uh, when we were dating. And that movie, I can still watch it today, and it just cracks me up. So I decided, well, actually, my buddy Corey uh, bought this bike to build into a Dumb and Dumber bike. And it's just set for like 10 years. So I bought it from him over Christmas. And in the past week, I have bought every part for this bike that matches the shows. And right now, that's the correct tires and wheels on it, but these are not the right ones. And I mean by correct, it's the TriStar uh, wheels. Let me kind of come down here and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Well, these are a, let me see, what are these, a seven inch or? Six, these are six, and I need fives. So I'm gonna take these, probably buy another mini bike, put these on it, and so I can get the littler tires and wheels on it because that's what was on the Dumb and Dumber bike. Uh, I'm gonna build the sissy bar, uh, the little wheelie bar. It, I have the basket, I have the seat. Uh, I have the correct streamers, the correct bell, uh, even the basket uh, with the correct headlight and tail light. Every, uh, I got the coontail, it's going to be hanging off the sissy bar. Uh, this thing is going to be a fun little project. Now here's the thing. Oh, and I also have the correct helmet and goggles to go with this. And I'm working on the briefcase, the correct briefcase. It's really hard to find, uh, but I'm working on it. So a lot of people are going to be asking, well, Rick, why are you building this thing? Well, I'm building it because I, I love the movie. And it, I, like I said, it was my wife and I's first movie that we went to. But uh, I want to have kind of around the shop just to play with. But I'm probably going to sell it. I mean, I, I do everything for money. Um, just something that I do. Um, and so the original bike, and, and I don't know if you guys know this or not, but there was two original bikes. Uh, one was a hero bike which was used up for all the close-ups, you know, and all that stuff. And then there was a bike that was used for like all the driving scenes, like when you see the aerial shot of them driving it and stuff, and that was what I'd call like the stunt bike. The stunt bike was uh, donated to, I believe, Planet Hollywood. I'm not sure which Planet Hollywood, but it went to Planet Hollywood, and I think the helmet and the goggles uh, went with it and stuff. And the, the hero bike was given to the guy who worked for the movie, and they, they gave him the bike. He sold the bike uh, to somebody down, I believe it was in Houston, Texas, and the guy had it for a long time. He was a big mini bike guy, and then he decided to sell the bike, and he put it on eBay, and the original Hero 1 bike sold for fifty thousand dollars and i'm not kidding it's actually like fifty thousand twenty nine dollars and ninety nine cents i i shit you not and so i thought well you know what if i built one i know i'm not going to get fifty thousand dollars um hell i would probably be happy with you know a fraction of that but uh it is a customized bike and the parts on it are actually really rare, like the helmet and goggles, it, just trying to find all that stuff. And, and you, you got to go off. It's not like there's a build sheet, uh, you know, like, oh, I went to this website and it said, this is how you build it. Like I do for the supernatural cars. I tell people like, hey, these are the parts and da, 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 da. This bike here, I mean, I've spent, oh, I, I've, I know I've got well over hundreds of hours just trying to locate things and trying to figure out what they were. 
I even found the correct, correct review mirror, and it's, it's just crazy. And a lot of this stuff comes from other countries. It's not even like, oh, this you just go down and buy this. Um, so I am not going to tell people how to build this bike because then everybody could go out and build it. And, you know, it kind of takes away the specialty of it. And I don't know if I would ever build another one. I guess maybe, you know, if this bike sold, sells for a good price, you know, and somebody goes, oh, I really wanted that. And blah 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 I might build another one and that's a might so because I still got a uh, stretch this frame and there's just all kinds of things that I'm gonna have to do to it but it should when I'm done with it it will look exactly like the, sh the show bike and uh, and I'm gonna do it crappy I mean because when they sprayed it they rattled canned it and they got paint like on the wheels and uh, it was just it was done nasty and uh, I am going to do it that way. I don't want it to look like, you know, it just rolled off a showroom floor on new mini bikes. Uh, it's going to look like old Lloyd Christmas had this thing. So this is my new project. And uh, I'm, this weekend I'm going up to a, a metal shop to get some more tubing. And so I can splice it in just like the show did. And... I'm just going, I'm waiting on parts to come in. I just bought a bunch of them. So they'll probably be coming in here in the next week, maybe two. Uh, maybe some a little bit longer because they're coming from overseas. Um, but I, I really am looking forward to this. And I'm even getting a jacket. It's not the exact same jacket that Lloyd wore, but it's really, really, really close. And the t-shirt the and everything. And... I don't know, I was thinking about like seeing if I could get my tooth painted, chipped or something, you know, and just acting goofy, because I mean, that's what this movie's all about, it's just goofiness and, and having fun. So anyway, I'm gonna sign off here. I just thought everybody, I mean, obviously there'll be more videos and stuff, but I just thought everybody might like to see uh, my new project. And uh, it's probably not gonna take me that long to build this thing. So, but however, if somebody, I don't know. I'll just throw it out there. If somebody is like, hey, I want that bike. That's my favorite movie and I got to have it and stuff. Contact me, you know, um, and, and I would sell it. Uh, but I mean, obviously, I'm going to get to ride it. So um, but if you're, you know, like that diehard of a fan, I don't know how. I mean, obviously, there's got to be a pretty big uh, uh, fan base for it. If the original bike went for fifty thousand dollars. Um, and I know, like I said, guys, I'm not going to get anywhere near that. Uh, or at least, well, if maybe I am. I don't know. Uh, but I doubt it. Put it that way. Uh, I think people in hell probably have a better chance of getting ice water than me getting $50,000 for a replica mini bike. But uh, the world's a crazy place. And, boy, let's just say all hope and dream for it. But um, anyway. There we go. If you guys are somebody out there that's really wanting Dumb and Dumber's mini bike, a spot on replica, contact me and uh, we'll, we'll talk and, uh, and see what we can come up with. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little odd video on my obsession with Hollywood m movies uh, and TV show uh, cars and trucks and uh, now mini bikes so I just thought you know what I think I've seen like a couple on 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 YouTube that some people have tried building that they called their dumb and dumber bike and basically had a basket on it uh, like a bike bell and uh, you know painted it red and it was like eh, it's not it you know if you guys know me I'm all about doing everything screen accurate so I pretty much dug up every bit of info I could on this uh, bike. I know who built it and everything. I don't think the shop is any, they're no longer in business, but uh, I'm not just somebody that just goes, oh, this is what you do. And, you know, I mean, I have to research everything out. So with that being said, I'm going to say goodbye to you. Like I said, if you're wanting this bike that bad, contact me. Uh, I have a feeling it'll probably start happening once I get the bike really looking like the 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 movie bike but 
you know, you guys can go back and look at my other videos on stuff that I build and you'll understand that I'm, it'll be exactly like Lloyd Christmas's hog, you know, and I'm sure this thing will get 50 miles to the gallon and, and we just might just ride it up to Colorado. I'm not riding it up to Colorado, guys. Um, but it's going to be fun to play dorkiness on. So, and I can be a big dork. So, anyway, that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if I hear from you, awesome. Talk to you later. Bye.